group that uh, we're, a lot of independent theaters are a part of is called the Art House Convergence, and uh, it's a thing that happens every uh, every Sundance, um, right before Sundance, and all the Art House theaters get together and they have a little mini conference, and, and it's, a, it's an organization where we kind of share content and ideas. And out of that this year, um, a group of the Art House Convergence got together and they put together a program called the United States of Cinema, and uh, and then tonight is the uh, the inaugural. Uh, nationwide screening of the United States of Cinema, which is uh, 1984. Um, and um, uh, so um, this screening will, uh, we're, everyone got to choose their own charity, so uh, we just we decided we're going to give a, a $2 for every ticket uh, to the uh, a National Endowment for the Arts. So give you guys a round of applause. Uh, we, uh, we here at the Texas Theater support Park Park Arts funding. We hope you guys do too. Uh, we're involved in a lot of other nonprofits here, and, uh, and uh, hopefully, uh, you know, uh, the arts can continue to receive national funding. Um, also, this is a great opportunity to uh, to give a little tribute to John Hurt, who just passed. So this was a kind of a great a great screening to do tonight. There's um, an actual intro and an outro um, on on this going to be part of this program. Um, and, the, and the outro is uh, an interview with Michael Radford, the filmmaker, who doesn't talk about this movie that much, so it's pretty interesting. Uh, and actually, um, it, was, it was produced out of Austin. They shot it overseas, but it was produced and edited out of Austin. And I think Mr. Tom Aberg, who's a commercial editor here in town, uh, is in the room, and he cut, this, he cut the video you're about to see, so that's pretty cool. Uh, all right, guys, let's watch 1984, and then stick around after the credits for the interview.